know I want a rematch. Yeah. We all want a rematch. Two times at 4640 Paradise, Code 4. I've been working the street crime unit now for about 10 years. Brooklyn, Williamsburg. There's uh, a lot of change that's going on in the neighborhood now. Become uh, gentrified somewhat, but there's still pockets here and there that uh, have the uh, older element when I first got on the job. About uh, nine years ago, uh, from that building there, a guy came out on fire, and my partner went after him to uh, see what was going on, and he sliced my partner in the neck. That shows you what kind of neighborhood it was. A lot of uh, prostitutes, street gangs, things of that nature, drugs, a lot of drugs. And uh, slowly but surely, when uh, property started going up, a lot of those people uh, got out of the neighborhoods. A lot of people that started caring more started coming in. But there's still pockets of uh, that kind of uh, activity going on. You always got to keep your eyes open. I drive this route. A lot of times, uh, sometimes about three times a week, you know, they always try to get you to change so you don't become a, uh, a fixture where if uh, the bad guys are keeping a surveillance on you, they can't pinpoint when you'll come around. So that's why we do a system where some uh, weeks uh, I'll be on this particular route and some other undercovers would be on this uh, route. But I guess now that I told you that, uh, they know. Want some help, man? Uh, in a minute, bro. When I was a kid, at one time I seen a guy trying to jump off a roof and a lot of people were making fun of the guy trying to trying to entice him to jump off the roof and all of a sudden these cops came out of a of a van and they uh, they coaxed the guy down. I thought they were heroes. I really did. I thought they were heroes. They saved this guy's life. And that's when I knew I wanted to become a cop. And that's really the reason why you want it. You gotta have to do it because you wanna you you wanna you wanna be part of something that uh, makes things better. It's about caring for people. You see? These homes here, people have been here for their whole lives, you know, and uh, they got every right to be there and not have to worry about uh, some knucklehead breaking in. Yo, take it off, take it off. Turn up. You see the gun, right? Yeah. I'm gonna make a turn right over here. This is, uh, we got a call about uh, two hours ago about the ladies hearing some kind of uh, dispute going on outside of, a, outside of a place over here. Take that money that you have behind the counter and just put it, yeah, put it on top of the counter. That's it. Put your hands down. I think we got something over here. 